Hello and welcome back to Before the Horizon and Animal Crossing New Leaf Let's Play. Last episode we got off a train and discovered we are mayor and today we are going to discover what that entails by going back here and sitting in this little back chair. Oh, Mayor Cloud, have you settled in and finished unpacking? I didn't have much so I'm all done. Wow, really? You must be really efficient when it comes to moving. My bedroom is completely full of unpacked cardboard boxes and it feels like I moved so long ago. Oh, sorry, please don't tell my brother I don't let him into my room for just this reason. Um, right, I was going to tell you about the town hall. Okay, for starters, the area where I usually stand is the service counter. It's the hub for all Lilypad info. I provide a variety of services at the service counter, such as giving people advice for living in the town, and I also listen to requests to change the town tune and flag, and I report on citizen satisfaction. However, to get advice or provide input, you'll need to stand at the counter just like everybody else. I can't go bending the rules just because you're the mayor after all. Now then, moving on. Oh, I almost forgot. Before you start laying out your vision for Lilypad, you need a town development permit. Getting the permit takes a bit of work, but don't worry, I'll help you out. That's what I'm here for. You sound pretty busy, Isabel. Me? <laughs> busy? Don't worry about it. I got a whole hour of sleep last night, so I'm just raring to go. Well, look at you. Your all instincts must be really good because you're already sitting in the mayor's chair. When you want to work on official mayoral business, just sit in that chair and I'll help you out. And come see me when I'm not overly busy so we can get started on your town development permit. Um, hi, did you need something? I know it's silly, but if you want to talk about Lilypad, you need to talk to me over the counter. Or if you want to flex your mirror. Oh, okay. Sorry, I mean, like, you were standing right there. I didn't want to make you have to walk all the way here, but I get it. I've got to follow the rules. Hello, my cloud. Is there something you'd like to inquire about? Uh, I need advice for living here, please. Give advice on making the most of your life here. After all, it's my job to make sure being a resident in Lilypad is top notch. However, I might need to get really detailed and talk for long periods of time. So, you know, it might be hard to listen to me go on and on. If you're in a hurry, hold down B and I promise I'll talk faster. I haven't got to know them, no, Isabel. Okay, so our first mission, should we choose to accept it, is to talk to everyone around the town. They're not staying long, but, you know, it'll be nice. Oh, let's see, got to do that already. Anyone home? This is Wendy's house. Nope, Wendy's out. Walt's house. Anyone here? Nope. <laughs> uh, next. This is Hugh's house. Anyone home? Uh, what you can do is you can look and if there's no smoke coming out of the chimney then they're not home. Oh, here we go. It's this Walt. Hey, Mayor, it's me, Walt. It's kind of stiff and formal to call you Mayor, so I'm just going to call you Cloud, alright? We're all counting on you to do your best. Pockets. Interesting. <laughs> uh, let's go over the bridge and see if anyone's home around here. They are. Who's this? Alice. She's a koala, if I remember correctly. Nice and cute. I can't do an Australian accent, so... <laughs> Mayor, I'd like to officially welcome you to Lilypad. My name is Alice. May I call you Cloud? I hope to become good friends, Cloud. But I know you're probably eager to get started with your new duties, so I'll leave you to it. See you soon. Oh, 
Oh, she bows. Love it. And the final person whose house we can visit is... Yep, and you're in, and you are Goose. Isn't Goose a chicken? We won't overthink it. Hey, Madam Mayor! I'm Goose. My hobby is training my bod. Mayors need plenty of physical stamina, right? If I were you, I'd train like crazy, but okay? That's not his voice. He needs a new voice. He's a bro. We need to start this again, Goose. Yo, Cloud, am I having deja vu, okay? Didn't we just talk? Just saying hi. Oh, really? Well, Goose. Hey there, Mayor. My name's Hugh. Nice to meet you, Snortle. Um, is it okay if I just call you Cloud? Calling someone Mayor all the time makes me feel like I'm in trouble. Besides, you look like a fun girl who has lots of fun, Snortle. We can eat snacks and drink juice and be merry and stuff. Three of my favourite things. <laughs> I might have to make a pig town at some point. I think I like it. Ooh, we have mail. Unknown sender. To Cloud, congratulations on your newfound mayorhood. To be honest, I was supposed to become the mayor, but... One thing led to another, and now it's all up to you. You'll do great. Keep it a secret. Mm-hmm. Sneaky, sneaky. One does not approve. But I'll get over it. Um, gonna need to get equipment and stuff so I can catch all these bugs and stuff I hear. Oh, I see somebody. Let me just get this last apple. Oh, wait. I've already... Oh. Hello. I only need a minute or two of your time. I'd be ever so grateful if you'd make your way over here. Oh, we need this character. Because that is how we're going to get our frogs. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, hello. As you can see, I'm a lamp. I mean, I'm inside a lamp. Rather important distinction. Anyway, I feel a bit awkward asking for another favour, but would you mind rescuing me? That's right, just pick up the lamp and take it somewhere quiet. Like your house, for example. I'll make it worth your while. What do you say? Come and then. Really? You'll do it? Oh, thank you so much. I'm a bit shy and I don't love wide open spaces like this. You never know who's looking at you funny. All right, I'll leave it to you. Hmm, my pockets are full. Um, yeah. <laughs> Let me just sort out my pockets so I don't ruin this. We are definitely going to indulge the secrets of the lamp. Um, but let's continue what we were doing so I don't end up forgetting. Hiya Miss Mayor, my name is Wendy. It's so cool that we have such a cool mayor. No joke, I'll do anything to make sure Lilypad is on the list of hot spots around here, Lambkins. I need a watering can and things too. Have I met everyone now? Look at our board. This tells you if there's any events coming up. But this one just announces that I met and how to use the menu board.
So let's go talk to Isabel, then I think we should go see Mr Nook and see just how much this house is going to cost us. Hello McCloud, is this something you'd like to inquire about? Let's find out about town satisfaction. You want to know how satisfied the citizens of Lilypad are? Here in Lilypad, we believe that citizens deserve to be heard. That's why we established a committee to gauge the needs of the population. So without further ado, here's the results of the last survey. I think it can only go up from here. So far to go. The citizens also say that they feel there's not enough greenery in Lilypad. They want more plants in the town. The fate of Lilypad lies in your hands, Mayor Cloud. And just know you'll do us proud. Okay. Anything I need to do as mayor before I sort out my house? I would love to work on my application for town development permit. Well then let me explain the prerequisites for the permit. First requirement is that you own a house in town. You're still living in a tent so you need to put together the down payment for your house first. Okay, the second requirement for the town development permit is to gain the approval of the citizens. In order to gauge citizen approval, I'll regularly survey the town's folks to see what they think of you. Best way to raise your approval rating is to improve the town and the lives of those who live here. Now according to preliminary survey, your current approval rating is 15%. Oof. The law requires that all applicants have a 100% approval rating, so let's make that our goal. Talk to me from the Mayor's Chair any time you want to know what your approval rating is. I can also give you advice on how to raise your approval rating. That's all there is to it. Good luck, Mayor Cloud. Okay, so our mission, should we choose to accept it, is to raise up from 15%. Goodness, so low. And in order, And also, we need a house. So... Mr. Nook. It is time for you to drop your huge mortgage on me. Welcome, welcome. Oh, Cloud, yes, yes, welcome. Have you finished everything you needed to do to move in? I have, of course, completed running the numbers on your new home loan. Yes, yes. Now, let us discuss the cost. You know, Cloud, we can't build you a house unless you have all the necessary costs covered, hmm? So the down payment is nothing more than a paltry 10,000 bells. I can't afford that right now. No, no, that's fine, you're fine. You needn't worry about giving me a single bell at this point in time. I'm quite a generous raccoon. My heart is about the size of a four-bedroom, two-path duplex, hmm? That being said, I do need your down payment before any work can be done on your home, okay? But do not worry, no, no, this town is rich in crops and other resources. You'll find it easy to earn money. You can collect fruit and seashells and take them to the recycling shop to earn quick cash, yes? Once you've saved a bit, buying a net or fishing rod at the store is a good idea as well. It is indeed. You can use the tools to go forth and catch insects and fish to sell too. Easy path to riches, hmm? Much faster than searching for low paying part time employment, yes? Oh yes, yes. So come and see me right away when you've saved up 10,000 bells. Good luck, good luck. So the beginnings of the game, I'm going to be honest. They can be a bit tedious because there's quite a lot of things that you have to do. Man, the sun sure does feel good today, don't you think, Schnortel? So anyway, what's up? Let's chat. A mayor should talk to all the people in town. Actually, everyone who likes Blabby, so don't be shy. People will be more than happy to share tips with you about settling into life here. All really excited to see how Lilypad will change with you here. Anyway, if there's still something you need help with, you should talk to Isabel at the town hall. She'll probably give you lots of advice on town life, Snortle. Oh man, I'm gonna need a pig town. It's official. Right, 
right, so let's gather up more of these apples because, I mean, they're a money maker. But unlike in Pocket Camp, they're not going to like grow back in three hours, more so pity. just love saying that good morning wow what do you want to talk about lambkins mm, don't know me you have a house now right well congrats to you now it's time to make your home truly all about you cloud if you need things for your home visit nooklin junklin for clothes head to the able sisters i love going to all the places along main street often since the stuff for sale changes daily i don't know if that's even the voice i gave you wendy i just don't know but it's the voice you have right now Yo, Cloud, good to see you. So, did you need something? No, Walt, just saying hi. Have you seen the fruits growing on trees around town? That's free fruit! Open for dips. Take it to the recycle shop retail if you want to sell it. It's actually a really simple way to start making money. Face a tree. Oh, Walt, darling, I know all about it. Ooh, I haven't done shells though, Walt. Thanks for the info. I think, I think, I think. Have we got everything? Right, gotta be careful with that. Yeah, I think we I think we've done all the trees. So let's uh go get some shells. Sell it all. Then go do some shopping and uh, put our down payment down on our house. Now there is a way to skip the tedium and as we get more into the customization aspects of Lilypad I will um, explain about that more but for now we're just gonna play the game organically even though it's gonna take a while Ugh, ugh no I'm still sleeping mm, No, I'm still sleeping Okay, fine. It's not every day a random pelican just passed out on your shores. But he doesn't want to talk to me. Right, we can pick up two more. And, oh, that's like perfect. It's like you knew. Can light go with like? No, these can't stack. Sad. But yeah, we've got more than enough. I think that Animal Crossing, <coughs> excuse me, is the kind of game that works well for streaming. So maybe potentially um, that will happen once we've got all these initial bits out of the way. Oh, hello there, welcome. Yes, can I help you? I want to sell Reese. I brought in lots of things, just, you know, take it off, take it all, every bit. Ooh, I have a pearl oyster shell, I'm not going to sell that. Let's see how much I'll get for this. That sounds fabulous. 
I'm on my way to my first hundred thousand. If only life was so easy. Do you know what? While we're here, let's buy a fridge. Oh, Hugh. I will. Let's buy a bed. This chair. Gosh, he's just selling out his house. And our first plant. Lovely. Now we did a little bit of shopping but we should probably pay our down payment before we think about going into Nooklin Junction. Welcome, welcome. Yes, yes, how may I help you? I have my down payment, Mr Nook. 10,000 bells just for you, enjoy. But it does. Okay, colour of our roof. Um, I would like a green roof, please. Yes, please. Okay. So that's one big step. Ooh, tomorrow. But before tomorrow comes, we're going to do some shopping. Then we're going to check our approval rating. And then, you know. This is the first time in our humble establishment. Oh, you've already met my older brother, Timmy. I hope you treat us both kindly. Please do. Our store sells a variety of furniture and useful goods for daily living. As you can see, it's rather a teeny shop, but please relax and enjoy shopping. Take your time. Well, we are definitely going to buy the fishing rod. I will take it. Thank you very much. No, I'm good. I've played this game a few times. And we are definitely going to buy the shovel. I'm okay, thank you, Tommy. Let's see what else is available. A uh, platform. Not really. Uh, why didn't I? But I do want this. I am, thank you. And I know that this will be helpful in the future. Now there's one last shop that we can visit as newcomers. Well, it's actually two shops, but like you can walk through, and that's the Aeol Sisters. Hello, welcome to Handmade Fashion Palace of the Aeol Sisters. Are you? By any chance, the new mayor everyone's talking about. Oh, everyone around town has been buzzing about you. 
So you're quite easy to recognize. As you can see, our store is mostly clothes. Our store mostly specializes in handmade clothes. If you like accessories, please look to the accessory shop that's right next door. That's their other sister. And we're definitely going to say hi because we want Sable to like us eventually. Sorry about that. She always gets like that whenever she's focused on something. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're going to buy all of this if we can. Academy uniform. I'd like it. It is. But you see, I have money. <laughs> Do I have space though? Am I going to have to come back? I think you might be alright. Yep. I will buy it. What's this? Oh, we definitely want some PJs. And we'll get the skeleton pants. Well, I think, yeah. We need everything. Let's check out next door. Get a little umbrella. Mm. I think that's all I would want. Now let's try on our new outfit before we go and see Isabel. It's stern, but it will work. <laughs> and now shovels can be used to dig holes. Um, you want to definitely, if you see these X's in the ground, you want to dig them up. And that's why, because you get fossils. you also want to hit stones because every now and then one of them will be a fake stone that contains There is actually a specific way to get more out of it, but we'll just be happy with this one. No, we'll pick it up after. Uh, yeah, and then there's another one that will be a gem. So it's always handy to have. Now you can see this present floating. Can't do anything about that right now because you need a slingshot. What is going on? I have to get my <laughs> my precision is off. Has it been so long? Uh, let's just bury it again. We're gonna have to clear out our pockets for sure. But yeah, let's see what our approval rating is, so that we know what we can do tomorrow. Hi, Miss Ma. Is there anything I can help you with? You'd like to know how much progress you've made towards getting a town development permit? Well, your house isn't ready yet, but you've made the down payment, so that's good. However, in order to receive your development permit, you need approval rating of 100%. According to a recent survey, it's at 15. Let me think of a good way you can gain approval. Why not compose a new town tune? Everyone loves a catchy jingle. Every time the citizens hear it, they'll think about you and how much you care for Lilypad. Just talk to me at the service counter to try your hand at And there you go. Okay, so that's a lot of little tushy things that we have to do still.
So I am going to get on making money. Let's see what happens tomorrow when we will be making a town tune. Hopefully having a, more of a house and um, getting our approval rating up again. It's really annoying. It's so low. But yeah, so I will see you next time, which in Lily Leaf will be the 3rd of January 2019. <laughs> Bye.